Well, good morning, coffee drinkers. Uh, we have another coffee review uh, to do. Uh, this morning, as you see in my uh, Montreal, uh, we'll get a little 360 like I can't should try to. See the Canadian flag there? Uh, yeah. 360 of the cup. <laughs> anyway, that my sister-in-law gave me when she was in Montreal this summer. Uh, but anyway, enough of drive about that. Um, today we're doing another one from Green Mountain out of Burlington, Vermont. Where well, incidentally, actually, they came back from when they came back here, or two when they came back here. This is their half calf. So just going right into it. To... There, the appearance. It's... Excuse the appearance in here. I'm changing my bed this morning, my bedding. As you see, it's a very typical brown, sort of lighter brown. Well, hey, it's half calf, so we expect I'm having it black to do the review, of course. Um, it says on the package, I don't have it here, but you'll, you'll see it in the thumbnail. Uh, that it's brisk basically with chocolate and walnuts, hazelnuts, and the aroma. So, let's go right to the aroma. While I'm doing that, you can, well, look at part of the can anyway. It's the cup, I should say. Hmm. Yeah, you know, I think I do detect um, nuts and chocolate. Yeah, definitely in the smell. So far, it's living up to its description. Um... So, uh, don't really have anything else here, so I'll so let you look at the scenery outside while I describe the taste. Yeah. You know, I like to have this with cream. So black, those notes are muted, but they are there, the chocolate, the nuts, the coffee. Yeah. It's solid yet unspectacular. So, just like if you've seen my uh, old Milwaukee Light um, review recently, I just like that, I think I'll give it a 3.75 out of 5, too. Cheers and good morning.